How's everybody doing? Okay. Uh, I gotta say, I love this room. You know, it's very uh, intimate and stuff, and uh, it just makes me want to connect. Is that, is that okay with you guys? To connect with you, just get real. Okay. Uh, something real about me is I have clinical depression. Or as my cousin would call it, a case of the bitch niggas. <laughs> my cousin is a fucking moron. He once told me the reason I'm so sad is because I wasn't getting enough Ja Rule in my life. <laughs> that's, a, that's a true fact. Uh, that's a quote from my cousin Dion. Uh, it's weird when you're black uh, because, like, in the black community, when you have problems like depression or anything, uh, we don't get professional help. We just treat our barber like our therapist. You know? I'm sure all you white people can relate. You, know? you get it? You understand? Uh, we do! And, like, I'll be at a barber shop and just, like, not even need a haircut and just complain all day. You know? I just be like, oh, Jamal. It's been a really tough day, man. It's been a really hard week. Like, I don't know if I can go through this anymore. I'll just be like, what? This is greenlit scandal for another season, son. Stay up. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> Friday's on TNT tonight. It gets better. <laughs> Stay strong. <laughs> Stay strong. Uh, I, I don't know. I have been having a rough uh, couple weeks. I, I've been like trying to like reminisce about like when I was like a kid. You guys ever do that? You know, think yeah. back when it was a simpler time. Uh, not even just like a child, but even just in high school. You know when all you needed was a wallet chain <laughs> and a Weird Al Yankee Bitch CD to get you through the day. You know? Just let Amish Paradise play on repeat. Just let the pain wash away. <laughs> beautiful stuff, beautiful stuff. Uh, a simpler time. I guess you guys were all rebels too. <laughs> cool stuff, cool stuff. Uh, no, I don't know, my life has been getting better though. Uh, my boss uh, at the job I hate Called me his go-to guy. Today. Oh no, no woo. Oh, isn't that the worst at a job you hate when somebody says that they need you? You know, it's like, uh, it's, it's almost like a woman telling you she loves you after dating her for two weeks. It's just awkward. You feel really just weird. Like, uh, you know, he complimented me, and on the outside I'm nodding my head like thank you, but on the inside I'm thinking, do you know that you're talking to the same guy? They got so insanely high, he accidentally left his nephew at home and went to go see Cars 2 by himself. <laughs> True story. I'm not the go-to guy. I'm not the go-to guy, my friends. Bad idea. Uh, really bad idea. Oh, boy. Another thing about myself, uh, I'm from New Jersey. Anybody else? Woo! Yeah, yeah. Shit. All right, the rest of the crowd hates us. That's cool. yeah. <laughs> it just comes with the territory. Uh, you know, I, I have a lot of friends from, you know, like, uh, out from like Midwest, West Coast, all that stuff, and they always ask me what New Jersey's like, right? And I'll tell you what I tell them. If you're a fan of a bunch of drunk Italians calling you one of the good ones, <laughs> Uh, the living New Jersey might be for you. It might be the best place ever for you. Uh, it's, uh, it's a great place. It's so, it's so solid. It's good. Uh, the, the best thing about going back there is I get to see my grandma, which is the most amazing thing. Right? Like, who loves a grand? Who doesn't love the grandparents, you know? They're just like the best. Like, my grandma, she's very nice. She has really wise words all the time. Like, last time I talked to her, she told me that she only listens to country music because she likes to hear white people cry. <laughs> How precious is that? How beautiful is that? That's so cute. That's so cute. She's a great lady. Uh, I don't, yeah, she's so nice, man. Another good thing, too, is I get to see my friends. Uh, you know, I actually came out here to a show that I did. And I did very well, as usual. As usual, okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty awesome. <laughs> and uh, you should have seen how angry they were that I did well, you know? Like, I don't know, right? I, I don't know what it is about guys and guy friends, 
But there's nothing better than seeing your good guy friend fail miserably at something that they love. <laughs> oh, it's just like the sweetest victory. You want to savor every fucking minute of it, every second. Like, I feel like women are so much kinder to their friends, you know? Like, if a woman sees her friend crying, she's like, oh my god, what's wrong? She tries to get to the root of the problem, right? If a guy sees his friend crying, all he's trying to do is take a fucking picture. <laughs> We're awful. We're just awful human beings. He's calling up all his other friends. He's like, yo, Tom's wife just had a miscarriage. He's crying like a little bitch. <laughs> But I feel like that's just saying that we'll be friends forever. That's just how men act towards one another, you know? Like, women are shitty too, just in a different way, you know? Like, have you ever hung out with a girl before, and you meet all of her friends, and then you hang out with her again, and one of them's missing? <laughs> they never tell you what happened. <laughs> she starts getting all cryptic and shit, talking like a fucking mob boss. <laughs> You're like, where's Sarah? Sarah fucked up is what happened to Sarah. <laughs> Sarah is no longer here is what happened to Sarah. Sarah's at Solos, where's the Phil Burke do okay? You should come by, it's a great show. Thank you guys, I'm Phil Burke. <laughs>